Okay, so this is round four of this week. Um, currently zero and three. I said I would post everything and po everything I will post, but damn it, this has been rough matchups. It failed. Felt like slight mistakes and our opponents always having it made it so. Like, I think the Storm game is just like, okay, uh, yeah, they have the Ancient Grudge and that kind of really stopped us the like dragon storm game i mean you can play dragons you can play that shows the same right so i don't know and then the this last game i mean i don't know it felt like uh what could i, I mean yeah maybe i was a bit too aggressive with my sacrifice like sacrificing things Hmm. Try to find an opponent. Yeah, so, but I think maybe I would have lost any. I mean, I'll rewatch the video after after this match. Probably after this will be the one I last one I play now. Three, two lions, metallic mimic, throne, building jar. This hand is damn slow. And again, they didn't they didn't represent a campaign. As you know, we're well, this hand at least has Ravager and has Ozolith, so I'll keep Ravager down. But yeah, the deck, I mean, the deck's feeling good, it's doing what it's supposed to do, I'm just not able to... Oh, I should play Mega Spinner down. Our result is the same, more or less. I would just have one less playing down. This feels like, yeah. Oh boy, we're against Wildos. <sighs> okay, please running my maxes. Well, hang on. Yeah, we only play it against uh, combo decks. Combo. Nexus Fade, you're gonna come in a combo, Storm, then Scape Shift, and now Bubbles. No, they're not combo, they are just decks that don't... I think people just gave up on, on trying to play fair against Prowess or against Jaunt. It just doesn't work. You always lose against Lurus, so why Why would you... I was like, did they path themselves? Sure. I mean, they also just keep it... They have what? They are a 5-5 five, five first striker, turn 1. I mean, yeah, we're not we're not winning this game for sure. Like, be miracle to win it. I'm gonna play a hangover. Try to see if they don't have a. Yeah, so I could play a spinning drum. That doesn't really matter. Gives me one more line next turn, maybe that's relevant. If I play a spin the drum and tap this. Maybe that's relevant. So play the hanger back. It's one life that we're not getting. I'm just gonna draft the thing. It's so funny because they, against that deck they can always they can always have six. It's so so good. If they don't have a trample or flying thing. May we have a chance? Okay. Well, I will block with the hangar back, but the thing is, it has vigilance, so. So I'll block with the hangar back, say okay. I will sacrifice the hangar back walker. Now, at least I don't get to win, get life, so. Always yield. Always yield. Always yield. I mean, I guess hunting skills does it. So why not? No, only green on. Okay. We don't have Lurus, sadly. Um, I 
I think what I'm gonna do it's a lot of cards I'm gonna play the worker sacrifice so well, let's count the kills just in case so if I play the worker sacrifice it three counters there's also like four counters here sacrifice that's five counters sacrifice that's six counters sacrifice six counters move here that's nine counters over here and this one has six is it a kill did we make it so okay i need to count it again so i play worker i sacrifice it and then i get four counters here from the worker and the sacrifice and one counter over here and i sacrifice one of the doctors then I get five counters here. Then I sacrifice the spinlet drum. I get six counters over here. Then I sacrifice the rubbish to itself. Move the counters over the top there. And here there will be nine counters with six from here and three from before. Nine counters moving into here. That will be nine plus six. That's 15 plus one. That's uh, 16. So just one short. God damn it. <laughs> There's only one, there's also one shot. Is there a way I could? No, I don't have black. No, I only have one black source. Man, this really deserves. Because yes, I could bring back the worker. Could bring back the worker with uh, with Lurus. And then that would be it. Okay, let's count it again, just for fun. I, I mean, we, we're not gonna run off time against Bogles. So that's four, five count, four counters in here. Second guy is here, five counters. Second guy is here, six counters. Sacrifice it to itself. Move counters. That's a 7-7. Seven, seven. That's 9 counters. 7 plus 9. 16. And there's 17. Yeah. Okay, so then we cannot do that. Um, then I'm gonna play the worker. I'm gonna sacrifice it. I'm just gonna move the counters over one of the doctors yes um i play a force yes so yeah do here yes that will be five that will be twelve we'll try to do the same thing again next turn of course this was a kill next turn we only had one more artifact maybe a walking jar or a uh, yeah. Well, it was close. It was close. It was good to count it. So we are bo they are bottling. They go to eleven. Of course, they had attack. They couldn't do this, but maybe the Russians? No, they don't have Russians. Sure, I think we won. I think we have just won because they will attack. We will do the same thing. Lock here. Okay, sacrifice, they deal nightmares to nothing, so so they actually don't gain any life. I mean, didn't they see it? It's kind of obvious. Okay, we won. They are hexproof though. <laughs> okay, I'm not even going to show them that, so I'm just going to sacrifice here. I guess also it's a new card, so it's kind of hard sometimes to know what it does. And this is a kill even without the. There's no maximum amount we could also sacrifice there, but. Yeah. Yes. And now you can see. Okay, interesting game. Post sideboard games. I'm guessing they're gonna side out the light lines and they're gonna bring in the. the Lurus's. So. Spellscape was good. We need to remember that. Uh, Welding Jar doesn't. It's not good. Probably some of guys is too slow. Um, Nature's Claim, Seal of Primordium. And I mean, if they bring in the Lurus, it seems like Fatal Push is the way to go. But will they actually bring in the Lurus? I don't know. Maiden Heal Spell Bombs is. Ah, no, that's super bad. I think we'll like, keep it like this, and if they do bring the Lurus, we'll bring Fatal Pushes for the last game. 
what about that? So we also have uh, access to Zamer. Make it got one in there, that's probably not gonna come into play for one type of push. Just in case. If you draw it against the the Lurus, that's super super good, basically. Interesting game though. Why would they tap out? If they had not, I mean I would have gone for it probably anyway, right? But Ninja's claim, hangout walker. This thing is not great, but it's deceivingly good. We can play Dano Reborn tapped. Play Hang of a Walker turn two, and then turn three, kill whatever, like if they have two, two auras. Okay, I'll try that. I don't think it's super, super, super great hand. But if we play Dano Reborn tap, then we play the Walker with two counters. We of course get to draw next attack. So we can Hang of a Walker with two counters. Oh, it's not gonna be okay. That's a bug. They always have it. Well, they also mulligan, so we're gonna give it to them. Good that you mulligan team. Okay, then we have a uh, hand skills. I think I'd rather play hand skills, right? So play Blooming Marsh, play hand skills. That's a turn. So next turn we play the hanger back, we take a hit, and then we need to claim next turn. The turn after. So that's, that's the plan, at least. I mean, it can go wrong in many, many ways. They didn't present lures again, so I'm happy they didn't bring uh, three path, three fiber pushes. Which I think is a mistake. You should have path lures. Like, ley line only stops the uh, walking ballista, which I guess is a way to win for us, but... So this is, gives them protection versus creatures. So they attack for two. Sure. I wish I, I wish I had one more mana, but I don't. Okay, Metallic Mimic. It's not a bad draw. This is like a backup blocker in case. So metallic meaning it is construct hang a back done. Then pass the turn. So next turn we're gonna hold on the the nature's claim. Let's see. Of course it's very different if you're in the play, but I think that's the only thing we could do. Like we couldn't get any other blocker earlier on Rancor. Yeah. So that's a uh, 4-2 with protection with, from creatures and, okay, that's not a big deal. Kind of block, so whatever. So Rancor is, when it goes into the graveyard, it turn Rancor to its owner's hand. Okay, that's an Igmoth, that's not a great draw. There's two things we can do here. We can play the Igmoth. And then where, if we draw our eyes next turn is a kill. That's thing one. Thing two is we can play the Diana Warrior Born Tap. But I think I like the Ravager line a little bit better. So we play the Ingmoth. Just pass the turn. Um, I don't even think I want to attack. Or do I want to attack? Because if they have Path in response, it really maybe sucks. Maybe I will rather double block. I'll attack with Mimic. They want to attack with Mimic. If they die, I don't want them to to trade this. Uh, attacking with Mimic puts them at 12. I don't, I don't want to attack with Mimic. Maybe it's a bit passive, but... Imagine they have a path to Excel. So let's see. Let's see what they do. So we need to claim the Spirit Mantle. It's a 3-1. We block. Okay. We pump. And the bubble dies. Then they get Rancor back, which is Fine, I guess. Don't use them trample, right? So, green. Another boggle. They have lots of them. And I get the blank over here. Trample, exclude, okay, sure. Okay, okay, okay that's, that's a kill. Uh, <laughs> so, so, yeah, we're just gonna go for it. We were already rewarded in this game. So, rabbit it is. Yeah. 
Yields. Yields. Thanks. Oh, you see it already? Yeah. Okay. I'll play the last one real quick and then I'm gonna go do something else. 2 0 which really did boggles, but wow, this league, man, we played only against decks that are not wanting to play. I mean, I guess the sketchy deck had counter spells, but they're not really into playing magic. That, that's kind of a sign of a not very healthy format, I guess. And everybody's just trying to go over the top of each other, they don't care about anything else. Aggressive decks are, yeah. Let's see what we play against. Okay, we'll lose mirror to end the day. This hand, we are going on the play. I mean, this hand on the play is, is good because we can actually find a land. We have two losses to find a land, and that's a great, great, great game. Yeah. Even if we don't find a land, that we have also it. Bubble. What are they playing? Is this Grixis? Oof, no bubble. They bubble themselves, no, they bubble us. Wonder what they found. Can you tell me one? Even if they if we don't find so that's a Delver. Okay, we're playing as Delver. Uh just this. Yeah. So they they shuffle the idea. Oh that's forest. So we're gonna play the forest that we know about and we're gonna play hand skills. So, a good thing to do maybe, if we draw a land. No, that's not a guy. So, if we draw a Lista, we're gonna play it and kill the Delver, of course. Toxis. My hand is quite redundant, as in a lot, so. I guess they take the hang back. I don't think they play engineer explosives. So in that case, I'm more likely to play even just the uh, ancient settings. I may well just play it actually. So I could play the ancient settings, have to look for a ballista, but maybe I can just do that next time, right? Um, Maybe they have interaction, that would suck. But I'll do it. I mean, if they have interaction, why not beta us into doing this? Maybe they, <laughs> maybe they have one, like... So, if they have interact, if they have the fatal push, why not leave the hanger back and expect us to do this play? Uh, 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 maybe just bad read by me, but... It looks like kind of redundant, right? Like, why wouldn't you... Why wouldn't you... Okay. As an insect, reduce force of negation, sure. 12 damage. You know what I mean? Like, if you if you have the interaction, why not play the... Yeah, this game looks pretty old, honestly. Yeah, why not, like, take out, like, an Ozolid or something, and then we... And then bait me into doing that. I don't know what to say to that, so I'm just gonna play the ancient things. Kind of black source. Yeah, you, you know, of course, you should be careful playing metallic mini against decks with interaction. They will almost always have a have a card that okay, yeah, force. Uh, I'm guessing I'm playing the scales or the yeah, I'm gonna play the scales. Hold on. No, I started on the. Still got on the venue. Uh, okay, another bubble. I mean, at this point, they just draw two cards a turn. I mean, we are not even close to playing Lurus. It's not looking good. They're gonna hit us for six, so we d we are not three turn clock. They probably don't have cryptic command. If that that shock tells me cryptic command. Um, I'm just this game. We're not gonna win. Yeah. 
I should just play the hangar like we thought it. Okay, so these cards are good in this matchup. Cards that are not great in this match. I'm gonna close the door one second, guys. Cards that are not good in this matchup. I think Spellscar is kind of bad. I think Mimic is kind of bad. I think one more can go. And those Blimley drums. I think that's good. Maybe we can even bring one Mimic back. Sometimes it could be good, but not more than one. Rolling Jar. Yeah, also deals with all their removal, so that's good. Uh, sadly, yeah, I'm not sure if we even win anyway, but because they had the rules and we had no answer. But yeah, this Grixis Delver deck is, uh, is potent. It's, it's, yeah. but I honestly thought, okay, if you're gonna. Okay, this hand's good. If you're gonna take out the hangar bug, why. Yeah, maybe they just thought, okay, if they will cast the hangar bug and have no, no answer to it. So, yeah. So I'll play the Ganor Waste. Take green and take the hunt skills. May I play the walking jar? I'm gonna play the walking jar, why not? I wanna play it now before they maybe they discard it. But I'm guessing if they if they thought scissors, they will more than likely take the hangar back. Oh Delver, okay. Ballista will be an amazing draw because it deals with Delver. That's not Ballista. Um, I'm gonna play the hangar that I only have one of. Ravager can, you know, if they have this, this, if they have a way to, to deal with the Ravager, then we can. So if they discard the Ravager, we have another one. Um, sure. They did not find like a spell. Inquisition, sure. I'm not sure they take the Ravager or they take the the, the Ancient Sphinx, to be honest. Both are fine cards. Um, if they tap out for some reason, I'm gonna put Count. Yeah, they take Ancient Sphinx, interesting. I'm gonna put Count, there's gonna be, yeah. So, maybe they do, they do, they do tap out. Black. Any thoughts is again of this member? Yeah, it's this member. Welding jar doesn't work against this member, so we just gotta let it go. But they do four damage, right? So whatever. F thirteen. So Ravager actually that's a four. We play Ravager, sacrifice it, so sacrifice here, sacrifice the Ravager, but that's, that's four counters, then it goes four here, that's five, that's not enough. Okay, I will just... Die with this tool. I could play Lurus. Or, but I would rather just get a Ravager in to play. And yeah, play this, last turn. At 11. Took a ton of damage from these members and the shocks. Again, they don't transform. That's another hand. Maybe they have Bubble and Lurus. But if they have Bubble and Lurus, they die. So we just okay. Why would you do 7 vision before you fetch? I guess they had no intention of fetching. Okay, that's not a bad draw. I'm, I'm gonna keep the Lurus for now, so I'm just gonna play the second Ravager. See what they do. Just gonna Welding Jab this Ravager. I'm 
not you know not particularly interested in, in going all in here they still have a they still could have interaction so I'll back and hold on this fiber push for whatever they play I just can see okay yeah I, I would just play it slow and from here and then as well eventually just next turn we can get uh, Lurus and welding jar back I think this sideboard worked the only thing I'm thinking about is maybe I would rather have a Mimic than have a... So I'd rather have a Spinning Drum than a Mimic on the draw. Because the draw, how the, the game will go, is the most likely will have interaction turn two. So maybe this gives me an extra mana that is actually relevant. Let's go. Yeah, I'm glad they didn't make me reveal them their, the Fatal Push. That's good. That means that they... Don't know that I have other pushes. They probably assume I bring them in. But one, two, three, throne, hanger ancient ceilings. Hands quite slow. Like really quite slow. Like Yeah, we can deal with Del, but if it doesn't transform, but if it transforms then it's really downhill. Keep seven. The two inches. I'm, I should have got an inches change, I think, for this matchup. Yeah, this hand's not much better, we have an earth. Yeah, worker seems kind of bad. All the rest seem also kind of bad, so. Maybe it seems is bad. I'm gonna play, I'm gonna put the worker away, I think. Not, not in love with this hand either. We have this card, I mean... But I think the other hand was just too slow. They would have taken the hanger back. I guess here they take the Ballista. Yeah, I mean, we're equaling cards because we, we are going... We are the draw, so... I think they can just Nothing to do with our mana, so I'm gonna conserve a life total. And play World on Tom tap. Probably gonna play Blooming Marsh and uh, tap. Okay, thought this. Yeah, well, that's. Sometimes it's like this to you. Oh, well, it's the, I mean, we couldn't really play it anyway, right? So I guess they just have Delver now. We know Fatal Push is a good draw. It's not Fatal Push. I think we just have to get the Throne of Geth down. I could cycle this, but I kind of want to play it. So I will play Gloomy Marsh. And they still kind of have a, it's not a super fast Cloud Builder of Secrets. So. Of course, next turn they can both, look, if they have Mishas Babel or something, they can Mishas Babel us and, and Lurus us. It seems probably they just do this, which is insane. Like just the turn they the turn they needed it. Okay, maybe it's two minions. Yeah. Okay, so they didn't flip it, that's good. That's good news for us. Um not not two visions. I mean two tires on top, so they draw one and they keep the other there. Interesting. Here's the blue for lands. Did they do it right? I'm guessing they need to play a line trial. Shocks again, wow. Neil spell one. Okay, okay. I mean, it's bad, but it's not the end of the world. Okay, the scales. You can play scales in moth. They can start. Uh, could also cycle and see if I can find something because this unearth. I mean, this is not gonna happen. This unearth. I think I'm gonna cycle this. I'm gonna cycle this uh, like this. This unearth is not gonna happen. 
Okay, so well, let's uh, work on that something at least. And that's the turn. I guess now it'll transform. They have a million views, right? I actually didn't see this card, yeah, I didn't see this card, so. So that's a lower rooms, I guess, oh, that's a death poly. Also, by the shadow, I was not, did not realize we were against this shadow until now. Counterbalance, wow, that's a crazy deck. Metallic Mimic, I mean, Metallic Mimic, Walking Ballista, B8. Okay. Please no counters. Snow cover island. Okay. Uh, Ivan Walker. Walker. That's the card we want. The other cards are not so good. Pendle Haven. There was an island, right? So I can play without fear. Yeah. Still an island. Still an island. So they will this will not transform, which is very good. So we have one card in hand. Um you have to be careful when not dying. But, so that's not transforming. They can cycle this, I guess. So that's an island, one card. That's Lurus, Demisius, Vowel. Classic combination. They didn't, I don't have blah. Bla. They should have, I guess, yeah, they don't draw. Should we. Should we start sacrificing here? That's four, six. But also I die to bold if I do that. Let's so if I draw a land, I can sacrifice this exile in my graveyard and I cannot play the I can play Lurus, but I don't get to play the Huh, actually maybe Okay, maybe it's good to do wait for this. I'll wait. See the draw line. The draw card. It's aligned. So I'm gonna cast Lurus now. Black, black, uncolored. I don't think they can counter it. It's counting down, so it's aligned. That's good to me to know. Now they need to react and heal spell on us. Sure. You cannot play with black, so we kind of lost the card there. Yeah. And now, now I have, have two options. options. I, I can, can make two doctors. doctors. I think yeah, I like making doctors and bringing, bringing this back. I could, of course. Oh, yeah, I could like this line more. So, so sacrifice here. So they're drawing a line, so that's not a matter. Proliferate. Proliferate here. Down. Then I play a worker. It's not aligned. It's still aligned. And um, that's the turn. So land. Of course, they can bring back Misha's Bubble. It's fine. They can even bring back the Heal Spell on this time around. I guess they drew an extra card. So they have land and a card, I don't know. But they drew first the land, so they, it's not a spell. So they drew a Heal Spell almost like. I don't know, they just brought it back. Okay. Okay. I guess they shot themselves again, but it's the same time. How do you do with that? Uh, 
that's these. What do they have? Syrians? It's not bad. Cool. Mm hmm. Okay, that's the other way. One gun in hand. They actually could sacrifice. I don't think they maybe actually can come to this system now. Oh, yeah, still fire. Damn it. <laughs> okay. So I can put. I can sacrifice yeah. Okay, you like today. So I don't get to Yeah, I should have done this first and then play those with that's true. Oh there it gets counted anyway. So that's nine doctors. Probably for it. Done. Another time, three cards in hand, still fire. That's really good, though, actually. I think there's a way they can kill me. I think there's a way they can kill me. It's gonna let it go, man. Okay, I think for damage it's not the end of the world. There are no flyers. Sure. Shadow, just one kind of hand left. Can't really get lower because then the doctor just kills them, right? Two. So let's sack here, put four counters, so it'll be five, and then probably five against six. That'll be six, seven, six, seven, and then one again. So can actually force also to. I can also force that the emote Nexus uh, gets a spell. Okay, it's a Ravager. Mm. So I actually could activate both Emos Nexus and attack with them, protect them with Tendalhaven and sacrifice. The only problem is that they have an. Uh, I have something that actually can, can stop it. Like, you know, I, I think I'm just gonna attack uh, with these nine guys and the Ingmod Nexuses. One Ingmod Nexus, maybe? Maybe that. Was it my that played the Ravager? I think I like playing the Ravager actually. I'll play it. Counterbalance. Please, no counter. 
Death Shadow. Okay, so we know they're drawing a Death Shadow. Cycling. So this just drew a Death Shadow. I mean, that's not a, that's not a big deal. I'm gonna attack with the Doctors and the Moth. Consist from the game. Okay, so two three in the end. I mean, once again two three. Mediocre result for mediocre play, I guess. Matches were so hard. I mean, this last game was rather fine, but the rest of the matches we played against Cape Shift. That was rough. Uh, we played against Nexus Reclamation, which is pretty hard matchup also. We played against Boggles and we played against Dragon Storm. I don't even know what to call it. But all those games were pretty rough. So, so yeah, this was a tough leak. Um, at least we got a 2 3. But I'm definitely bleeding a lot of play points lately. But yeah, thanks for watching and I'll catch for you with you next time. Just we can have a look at the list. Again, I'm not too sure that I would like to change anything. And if everything felt fine. Nice spell guide I would like to change, but I'm looking forward to those changes in Companion, see what uh, what that brings, maybe it just shakes out the game a little bit, and I think it's much needed, because people I think are losing patience, and they're just playing, you know, like these big things that sometimes they watch, sometimes they don't, but at least you don't have to sit there, and like this last game, if we didn't have lethal, basically you can see how they keep on drawing cards, I mean that was a weird deck that opponent had, we played against a lot of weird decks, this was a weird deck, anyway. Thanks for watching, and I'll catch for you next time.